All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna go over how to remove mobile apps from your display campaigns. So you wanna make sure that your display advertising campaigns aren't running on mobile apps. Let's just say they're not performing well for your campaign. You're getting too many clicks from mobile apps that aren't leading to conversions. So this is how you remove them altogether. I'm gonna show you two ways to do it. And the first is using the Google Ads interface. So what you wanna do is go to your Google Ads account, open up your display campaign where you wanna remove mobile apps. And what we're going to do is we're going to come over to placements here. So you can start by looking at where your ad showed. And what you might find is as you scroll down, let's say your ads are showing on mobile apps and it's just leading to clicks, but no conversions. So you want to make sure you remove them all together. So under the placements tab up at the top, we're going to click on exclusions here. So this is the manual method to do it right now. It's showing I have no placement exclusions in my campaign. So we can click here and click on exclude placements. We're going to add placement exclusions to the campaign level. We're going to come here to app categories and we're going to remove windows phone apps and then what you would need to do is for google play you're going to have to remove each one of these manually so you have to go down the entire list unfortunately they don't have an easy way just to remove these directly from the google ads interface i'll show you a quicker way of doing this but you're gonna to have to click on each individual one and same thing go to the apple app store click on each individual mobile app category to remove mobile apps from your campaign so to make sure this video is not too long, I'm not going to click on every one, but I think you get the drift. You go all the way down the list, click on every single one, click on save, and that's going to remove all these different apps from your campaign and all these different app categories. Now, the main ones I really do exclude, if you're going to make sure you do this a little bit quicker, is come to exclude placements, and you would go to app categories here, and then in Google Play, if you keep scrolling down, you're gonna see games here, so 18 under games. So what I generally do is make sure I exclude all these different games because as people play games, there's a lot of accidental ad clicks and a lot of people don't convert when they're playing games on their mobile phone. So make sure you add all of those, click on save, and you can do the same thing in the Apple App Store as well. So this is the manual way to do it. You would wanna make sure you go to exclusions here, click to exclude placements, and then when you exclude placements, click on every single different mobile app category to exclude all of them from your campaign. Now the other way to do this is with Google Ads Editor. So Google Ads Editor is a piece of software that allows you to manage all of your Google Ads campaigns and make bulk changes much easier. So what we can do is we can open our Google Ads Editor. You wanna make sure you sign into your account. So you would open your account here and then any changes that you made in Google Ads, I always do guess, get recent changes before I work in Google Ads Editor. Go to more data, all campaigns, click on okay. So it'll download any changes we made to our account. You're gonna see we have changes for our farmhouse goals display campaign because we just removed those mobile app categories from it. We can click on done for right now. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on our display campaign. So we're looking at campaigns here. We click on our display campaign to the left. And what we wanna do is come down here to keywords and targeting. And this is where you manage all of your targeting and your negative targeting for your campaign. Keep scrolling down, you're gonna see mobile app categories negative. So we're gonna click on that. You're gonna see there's a bunch that we've already added. For right now, I'm just gonna remove these and click on post changes. So any changes you make here, you have to post. So you're posting them to your Google Ads account. Click on post. And now it's showing we have no negative mobile app categories. So what we wanna do is click here, add negative mobile app categories, campaign level negative mobile app categories. And what you can do is click on all of these different app categories right here to get started. Click on okay. So that's gonna remove these categories from our campaign. And then just to make sure that we remove all of them, we can always come in here, do campaign level again, come to the Apple App Store, start from book and just scroll all the way to the bottom. So it's book down to weather for the Apple App Store, click on okay. And we'll do it one more time here, campaign level, go to Google Play, start from art and design and scroll all the way down. If you wanna make sure that you select everything, you can expand these menus as well. So games, family, you can expand some of these and then start at the top, come all the way down to the bottom here. So this one is weather as well, click on okay. So now we're making sure that we're moving all these different mobile app categories from our campaign. So what we can do is just click on post changes and now we've removed mobile apps from our campaign completely. And this will ensure that we're still running mobile ads, but we're not running any of our mobile ads on mobile app categories. So we can click on close and now we posted our changes and they should all show here as well. So if we refresh the page, it'll have all these different mobile app categories excluded from our campaign. So you can see here, we have the all apps one and then we have all of these different app categories excluded from our campaign. Now, the other thing you can do is you can always look at devices here and see how your campaign is performing on different devices. 
So if we look here, mobile phones, tablets, I'm not really getting a ton from computers, really nothing from TV screens. So if you're seeing some data from mobile phones, tablets, computers, and something's not performing too well, you can use mobile bid adjustments here to lower your bids. Or if you come over here to settings for your campaign, you can remove specific devices altogether. So if we come over here to additional settings, what you can do is under here for devices, rather than showing on all devices, you can do set specific targeting for devices and remove some of these if you really want to, if your campaign's not performing well there. Now what will happen is it's really gonna narrow down your campaign if you're only targeting computers. So generally you wanna target everything and you can use mobile bid adjustments if you need to. But this is how to remove mobile app categories from your campaign to make sure that your ads are not showing on mobile apps. And if they still are showing, you can always go into placements and remove those placements. But when you do remove those mobile app categories, your ad should stop showing on mobile apps altogether. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.